Different users of the Motorola phone are getting several SIM card failure errors, either right after installing the SIM or randomly, like no SIM card found or installed, no service, invalid SIM, etc. So we're going to suggest you some quick tips that you can follow all by yourself to fix this problem. Now we are using Motorola Edge 50 Fusion for this video, but the process is the same for any Moto phone series like EG, Stylus, or Razer running on Android 15. Okay, now first, quickly, what you can do is just swipe down the control panel, expand it, and then from here, just turn on airplane mode, wait for around 12 to 15 seconds, and then just go ahead, turn it off. This will restart and refresh the network as well as if there is any minor glitch that's causing this problem, we'll solve it. Now if you're still getting problems like SIM not provisioned, now just go ahead open up settings on your device from yes network and internet, enter your mobile network. If you're using dual SIM, enter the specific SIM settings and from here turn it off just to restart and refresh it. Wait for around 10 seconds and then just turn it back on again. Now after that, stay in the same section and scroll down for some minor settings like in preferred network type, make sure 5G is selected and also automatically select a network option is enabled. If you are still getting the same type of problems, now go ahead, open up settings once again, scroll down for apps, either from the top or from see all apps find out SIM toolkit, enter and from storage and cache, clear cache of the SIM toolkit app and then clear storage. And then force quit this section. Now, if your problem still persists, now we're gonna just reset network settings on our Motorola phone. For that, open up settings again, just search for reset. Go to reset options, enter the reset options, and here tap on reset mobile network settings. Now, if you're using dual SIM, go to both of your SIM settings one after another. And on here, just reset settings of your mobile network. Now, if you're using dual SIM and one SIM is working, but another is showing this kind of SIM failure errors. Now we're going to just go ahead and check if there is any problem with the physical SIM or not. So for safety purpose, first we're going to turn off or power off our device. Now after that, with the help of a SIM ejector, take off the SIM tray and then take off the SIM or both of them if you're using a dual SIM. Now look for any physical damage on your SIM, especially make sure there is no dust, debris or water in the SIM, especially in this metal area. Just go ahead and clean it properly. And while you're doing so, don't forget to clean the tray and the tray slot on your Motorola phone as well with whatever is available to you. After everything is clean, insert the tray along with the seams once again, and then turn on your phone back again. Now, all this process we've shown you so far is enough to solve your problem. Apart from that, I'm going to remind you some specific areas might cause this no service or no signal problem. In that case, try to change the place and then see if now your SIM is working or not. And finally, if everything fails before contacting with your carrier provider, use this exact SIM with another device if available to you. Or vice versa, like use another SIM to your same Motorola phone just to make sure what exactly is causing the problem. Let us know in the comment section which combination of the process actually solved your problem. Thanks for watching.